Good day, everybody. How are you all? Today, we are going to talk about standard normal variable. So without further ado, I'll get started. Says the heights of all NBA basketball players are approximately normally distributed with a mean mu equal to 79 inches and standard deviation sigma equal to 3.89 inch. Calculate z-score for a player with height of 77 inches and interpret the z-score. That's part A. Part B, if an NBA player reported a z-score of 3.5, then what is his actual height? Okay. So, uh, let's uh, start with the Definition of the standard normal variable. Okay. Z is equal to X minus mu. Oh, get that. Let's clear all of this. So Z is your standard normal variable, right? So. Let's change the color. Okay. So we start with the definition of Z. Z is your standard normal variable. And Z is given by X minus mu divided by sigma. So basically, it is the difference of the number X from the mean. That is the numerator, X minus mu, divided by standard deviation sigma which actually means a z-score tells us how many standard deviations you are above the mean or below the mean. Above the mean is the z-score is positive, below the mean is z-score is negative. In our case, z is equal to x is 77 inches. So x is, uh, let's move it a little bit up. So, So it is over here, 77 minus my mean is 79. I get that correct. It's 77 minus 79 divided by sigma is 3.89. Okay, let's make sure that is correct. Okay, so I'll reduce it a little bit. Yeah, 3.89. Okay, so 77 minus 79. That is equal to minus 2. The reason is 79 is greater than 77. So from 79, you subtract 77. 79 minus 77 is 2. And then you put the negative sign because the larger number, 79, the negative sign in front of it. And that is divided by 3.89. And then we will use our calculator to find that z-score, which is 2 divided by 3.89, which is equal to minus 0 0.514. What does it mean? It means the person or the player with height 77 inches, 77 inches is inches, I should say, inches is 0 0.514 standard deviation below the mean, standard deviation below the mean. It is below 
because the z-score is negative below the mean. Okay, that's what the meaning of this uh, z-score of minus 0.514 for a player whose height is 77 inches mean. That z-score is 0.514 standard deviation below the mean. Okay, so that's the interpretation. Now we are going to do part B. So I'll move a little bit up, create some space for us. Okay. So part B, we will do now. So part B. So part B. The Z score is given to the Z score is given to us as equal to 3.5. And remember, Z is equal to X minus mu divided by sigma. So if the Z score is 3.5, it is equal to, we do not know the X, the height, minus the mean, which is 79, divided by 3.89. So we have to solve for X. The easy way to do it is to multiply by 3.89 on both sides. 3.89 with 3.35 and uh, 3.5. So this 3.89 cancels with 3.89. And now we have on the left hand side of the equal to sign 3.89 times 3.5, which is equal to 13.615. 615, 13.615 is equal to x minus 79. Now add 79 on both sides of the equal to sign and you get X is equal to 79 plus 13.615. So that answer is 92.615. So the person who, or the NBA player whose Z score is 3.5 his height is 92.615 inches. I will stop here today. If you have any question, comment, please write me a note. I'll get back to you right away. And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. I really appreciate it. And if you like this video, please let your friends know about it so that you and your friends can subscribe to my channel by hitting the red subscribe button at the bottom right corner. Uh, thanks for watching. I will see you next time when I will come back with another interesting problem, interesting solution. Take care. Have a nice day. See you next time.